starting off with an another adventure and an another growing my mental health like with my favorite person along with me right now i am in the middle of an airport and i'm just trying to take the feeling out of myself that you know i'm going on a journey again this time it is a different phase of an adventure and different phase of a nature where like most of the times i have been to jungles and rainforest and right now i am going to be most of the time in the middle of water and with this feeling of anticipation of having you know so many thoughts about how i am going to spend the days and be a little bit more into nature and i know that you know this memories will give me those things i'll keep a hold of it forever i think we are doing vacation after so long matlab kitna time ho gaya hame waise vacation pe jaate hue हाँ, एक महीना क्योंकि हम लोग नोटिस नहीं घूम पा रहे तो अभी घूमेंगे ना वापस जाके फॉर मी दिस ऑफ ट्रेवलिंग फील्स मोर बेटर यू नो रेदर देन स्टेइंग इन वन प्लेस इवन दो आई एम इन माई होम टाउन एंड आई नो आई कैन ट्रेवल अ लॉट यू नो बिकॉज ऑफ दिस ओनली वी आर नॉट ट्रेवलिंग देर ना वन वी आर डन दिस वर्क देन वी कैन फिगर दैट आउट Backpacking to a city of lakes like Udaipur is not just about the destination it's about a journey as i navigate the winding roads and watch the landscape change there is a sense of excitement that builds with every mile each turn reveals something new whether it's the distant glimmer of a lake the shadows of a palace or the quiet sound of a real life the air feels different here fresher as if it's filled up with the stories of the past बारिश हो सकती है पर और हुई और हो सकती है क्योंकि देखो ना का, बादल काला होके रखा है ओ, ये बेकन पत्थर बन गया है क्या Each place has its own story and history and as I explore I am imagining what life was like for the royalty who lived there by visiting these historic sites and places I am going to know about their grand past and feel a special connection to the city's rich heritage What are we doing? We're going for a stroll. It's not a stroll kind of stroll. We are going to just explore some parts of Udaipur and then let's see how it goes. And also fix my broken phone today. Yeah, I am out for exploration of some ancient historic places. I really like to explore some other places where I can see the authenticity of Udaipur. In overall, I can see that the place over here is quite aesthetic and beautiful and with the mountains nearby, it's so serene. I can feel the air just 
passing around my face. It's quite amazing. I get to travel and see places like this all over India. It's not only about nature, all the ancient places, cultures that the kings and the people who has been in the ancient times have created with such craftsmanship and with such skills and I would really recommend people to you know come to Udaipur. In India there are some places which people have not yet explored so much but these places are really very exquisite and very serene. It's my first day over here and I feel really excited for the coming days that I, I'll get to see a lot of other things which I haven't seen yet in India because I have been traveling in India in lots of the places but I have been to the mountains most of the times but in the plains I, I, I really would like to you know explore places which holds lots of beauty and such craftsmanship. For me, anything and everything around nature makes me feel alive, helps me in healing in a lot of ways and I feel like that people should understand how to preserve this nature. It will stay like this for some amount of years and people have started constructing houses in these beautiful places. I feel like that, you know, preserving nature like this through our eyes with all those memories will be much more precious than seeing in a commercial TV or in a camera. So right now I'm gonna have some barbecue pizza and it's our lunch time and we are going to check out from this place and then we are going to the next place. Since while we were waiting for the cab and then right now you know we just we just thought of having our lunch. So it's just you know too much of a hectic thing but of course we cannot say no to pizza. So let's let's just try this. Hmm. Like it's very rare that we have pizza um, like most of the times. Yeah. Oh, it's okay. Mm. 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 <laughs> because I feel like food is a way for a girl's happiness. Like of every human being's happiness. We are finally in the new place, at the new destination. And they have provided us with this welcome drink. So let me just try it. It seems to have some flavor of pan and uh, supari along with it, like something traditional. So I'll just try it. It's very sweet and, and the flavor is like, like pan. Already told me that this is filled up with the liquid of pan flavor and something supari. Supari means the bit, the sweet, sweet version of bitter nut. So this is quite, quite good, but very sweet for me.
I just finished, uh, you know, getting ready, and I'm wearing a halter neck top, and uske saath mein pehen rahi hu. I think this is somewhat uh, similar to some traditional dress of Jaipur. I bought this dress far back, like uh, two or three years back, and then now this is actually. Coming in use, or may I say, shoot kill use karunga jaratar. I think I'm going to add some Indian jewelry along with it, pairing this up for my neck. I'm gonna wear a very simple uh, earring. I just want to, you know, add a big chunk of jewelry on my neck. It gives a little bit of a different vibe. It feels like I'm living the dream of being a princess even if only for a few days. Staying in these grand places and forts let me experience what royal life might have been like. Walking through beautiful halls, waking up to the views of peaceful lakes and hearing stories of the kings and the queens who live there makes everything feels magical. For a short time, I get to imagine what it was like to live in such luxury and it's like dream come true. Thank you so much for staying by along with this journey and I'm going to see you again.